Hello, hello, and welcome back, Frags and Beer family. I'm your host, Zayma. This is Indie Spotlight. Sorry I'm a little later than usual today. Uh, work ran a little over, so I had to stick around and help with a couple things. But now I'm here with you with another live review video, look at some music, some indie music from Brandon Hart. Um, check out the links in my video description below. Find the ways to support this channel. The easiest way you could support the channel is please click that subscribe button. We need 21 more, I think, subscribers to get to 200 when I will start giving away free audiobooks. I am an author, so you could check out my website and link to below, and you can find my books as well. That's one way to keep this, uh, keep supporting our channel, and you get something out of it. You also get rewards with our subscribe star page. Um, you get a discount at thebeardstruggle.com if you use my code BEARDWIZARD99. Uh, and finally, check out the merch store where you can get your own Frags and Beer merchandise. So I wasn't sure which. I wanted to do Brandon Hart today. I wasn't sure which one, and I found this song, Rowcliffe. Um, and I listened to it and I really enjoyed this song and I really wanted to bring this to you. It's a tough song. Um, the meaning behind it is, is tough, but I think that it's, it's a beautiful expression from Brandon who once again sort of shows us his range and his ability with his voice. Um, this doesn't sound like hardly any other of his songs that I've heard so far. So him showing his vocal range and his ability is is really cool. Uh, so we're going to take a look at this. The one thing I don't know is exactly the inspiration behind this song. I did look and I dug and I really wanted to convey that to you guys. So if anybody who's watching the live stream, thank you for being here. If you know who Chris is... Um, please let me know. I had a hard time finding any information about this song or why he wrote it or who Chris was. I, I kind of get the idea, but I don't know exactly who this guy is. Um, but anyway, yeah, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know you're here. Then when we're done, go do the same at Brandon's channel. Like, comment, subscribe. Give this guy some love. Hey, Eldefonso, welcome back. Oh, appreciate that very much. I really do appreciate that. Thank you. All right, so without further ado, we're going to jump into Rowcliffe with Brandon Hart. It was one of those days that I didn't want to wake up again. Yeah. I'm not saying I'm depressed, but it is what it is. Yeah. Got me thinking about my best friend, Chris. Why'd they have to do him like that? Yeah. It's been years since he's gone, and it still fucking makes me mad. Yeah. I wanna pick up my phone and play you a song If you were still here, I bet that you'd be on The TV or radio, they play your songs Everywhere I go that I know But you're not here, so I guess I have to tell them in mine I remember staying <sighs> Told you this was gonna be a tough one Um the idea of wanting to reach out and pick up the phone and talk to somebody who's not here anymore. Um, it's a kick right in the head. Um, because there are times where it feels... Um, I'm sorry, this one's going to be rough. Um, there are times that I still wake up or um, wake up from a dream and think that my mom is still alive and I can call her. And that's tough because then it, it takes a minute sometimes to settle in and realize that you can't do that. Um, that's why I started writing to her in a journal. Uh, and then when my dad passed, you know, I, I had I struggled with that a lot and I can feel that in my gut what he's talking about here and that's that's such a hard thing for anybody who's lost someone that that you want nothing more than to to tell them about something that happened in your life or uh, a promotion or you met somebody or some major event or something and you can't you can't call them can't email them you can't talk to them and that's um that's a tough one right there that really is 
and and just want to like you you're you, it takes your brain a while to realize you know you see something or you think of something you're like oh i should show that to them and you can't you know you can't reach out and play them a song or call them i remember staying up late night i remember drinking till the sun came up i remember road cliff i remember thinking that we were so tough i remember moments well sometimes they're not enough you're gone but never forgotten till we meet again it's all love i remember road cliff So his voice is so good, especially with this song. Um, it's it's very calm. It's very mellow. It's very peaceful. Um, and I think here, I think that's what he's trying to express. You know, he starts out a little upset, a little angry about what happened to his friend. But he's very much now sort of expressing, hello, Carol. Thank you for stopping by. He's very much expressing now uh, sort of a piece um, about all this. And you do get to that moment when you when you when your soul has accepted the loss of somebody. Um, it doesn't ever stop hurting, but you come to a point where you're more at peace with it. And I think that's that that pitch and that tone of his song that he's using right here is is perfect for that now you play your guitar when we came home drunk yeah you have a living room filled with the town's misfits and the punks yeah i'm not saying it's a flop house but everybody knew it on a block house that i know i give anything to have me one more night i remember staying up late night there are, <laughs> sorry, um, there are moments, I can understand that, there are moments when I would give anything um, for one more day, uh, one more phone call, one more conversation, uh, one more chance to um, say the things that I might not have said. Um, that's tough. One night, I remember staying up late night. I remember drinking till the sun came up. I remember Road Cliff. I remember thinking that we were so tough. I remember moments. Well, sometimes they're not enough. You're gone, but never forgotten. Till we meet again, it's all love. I remember Road Cliff, yeah. I remember moments, yeah. I remember Road Cliff, yeah. I remember moments, Um, sorry. I watched this once already today and I didn't, um, I didn't realize how much, well, I should have realized how much talking about it was going to do. Um, anyway, great song. Um, very beautiful, heartfelt homage to his friend. Um, yeah, it, that's, um, that's a tough one. Brandon's got a knack for delivering some very heartfelt uh, lyrics and stories in his songs. Um, he's got a very passionate uh, voice 
when it needs to be and also a very calm and mellow voice when it needs to be um yeah that that's thank you so much for joining me Alfonso, carol and anybody else who was in the live stream if you're watching the recording be sure to let me know what you think um we'll be doing some more obviously as many days as i can uh, where this was my 490th video, actually. Uh, so we're getting close to 500 very soon. Uh, so I'm excited by reaching that milestone. Um, thank you guys so much. Uh, remember, grief is good. Uh, as much as it hurts, it helps you move on. So much love to all of you. Thank you so much. Much love, Ildefonso. Thank you. Thank you, Carol. Everybody, you have a great night. Go show Brandon's channel some love, and I will see you again soon. Maybe some game streams here in a little bit with some new stuff and more music tomorrow. Thank you, Carol. I will see you all soon. Much love. Bye.